Let's talk about working memory and mindfulness skills and ADHD. Working memory is what we use to take in new information, to help us connect information. It helps us with planning and reasoning and problem solving and so that we can be able to follow directions and remember what we need to remember. But in order for our working memory to work, we need dopamine. And the problem with ADHD is that our dopamine is low. So when it's low, we're gonna use cortisol so that we can remember what we need to do at work and at school so that we can remember all of the, the calls and bills that we have to pay and so forth. But we're so stressed out because of that cortisol. We got to keep it so high so we can remember all of this. And guess what happens? We get stressed out. And when you get stressed out, everyone says you need to do mindfulness skills. So we close our eyes, we do our breathing exercises, and we do our mindfulness. And all of this starts to leave us. Our worries, our what we need to remember, because we are resting and lowering that cortisol. Well, for those of us that have ADHD, when I do that, I end up feeling like I have dementia. I don't remember anything. What call did I have to make? What was I supposed to do today? I might feel great, but I don't remember a darn thing. That ADHD brain relies on that cortisol to keep it all together. And when we let that go, it disorients us and we forget where we are. We forget what we're doing. So for those of us with ADHD, mindfulness skills can be exceptionally challenging as it disrupts our coping mechanism that we have been using to compensate for that low dopamine. I'm Dr. Sean Horn, the shame-busting psychologist. Let me know if you identify with that.